So what is up everyone, this is Kiran here, welcome back to Tech Kiran YouTube channel. This one is Shapeshift OS, which is based on Android version 11, the latest official update and Shapeshift OS version 2.4, which I've installed it on my Poco X3, it's available for some other devices also, which I'm going to share with you the link in the description. This one is the latest Shapeshift OS version, which has a security patch of 5th of March 2021. And if you're looking for some other things, for example, in this build, we have this G apps build which is Google apps build it's almost available for other devices including Google apps so which means you will not be able to you would not you need don't need to install Google apps separately for that so this is one of the thing which I personally liked about this build this one is I've installed in my Poco X3 I'm just gonna share with you my opinions about this shapeshift OS that which are the features and things you get here for example this one is a this kind of notification panel the quick settings panel which is customizable we have this kind of YouTube music option which means if you are playing music you'll see this kind of tile which is a very interesting feature of Android 11 including the notification history it also has a background blur option which you can disable in settings if you want to and also if you're moving for the home screen settings which is the default launcher the icon pack option is there add app icons to home screen but the feature is missing from here is the app lock which I was looking for but unfortunately it's not available but it depends upon your device maybe in your case you will get but almost in every device you will not get this app locker option available right there if you're looking for some other things let me share with you one more thing that this one is the shapeshift os version 2.4 it is not the previous version it is 2.4 the latest update version and as you can see if you've changed the ascent color you'll see the shapeshift os color also change the about phone logo is also changed it just enables almost every color everywhere which seems to be interesting one sorry for sometimes the focus just goes away now let me show you one more thing about this builder let me show you some other things about this shapeshift os it has the normal icon pack i haven't applied any custom icon pack yet but you can apply very easily as you can see we have the google camera go edition and google camera the google camera go edition is pre-installed but i've tried to install the gcam 8.1 which is working perfectly fine and if i go and test my full hd 60 fps on my poco x3 in my case i can record in full hd 60 fps the 4k 4k 60 fps is not working but 1080p but 60 fps is working perfectly fine so there are no bugs in the video recording google camera go edition is pre-installed which is kind of a basic camera but still a very good choice and it is far more better than the normal snapdragon camera if you compare it with a uh, compare it with if you're looking for some other thing let me show you some things about this build about this shape shift as you can see we have the normal kind of volume panel if you're looking for it and including that let me show you some other things about this shapeshift os i tried to play some games like truck and some other things which were working perfectly fine didn't got any frame drops etc which is good here if you're moving on the settings let me share with you some settings options as this is shapeshift os so it comes with shapeshifter which is a very cool kind of things where we have some customizations options available for example power button navigation gestures volume pack well volume rocker Interface includes theming which is one of my favorite things and I have applied this red ASIN color you can change this according to you and also includes many system icons customizations it has the fonts customizations I have I this one is the default fonts but actually these are uh, these are customized and I have installed a magisk module to customize them one of my best features one of my favorite feature is the less boring heads up has up notifications which you can customize including that we have some customizations for status bar icons network indicators battery related things so almost every perfect thing every interesting thing is available in this build for example a lock screen customizations it available there general options and at last we have this general notifications miscellaneous led settings and the gaming mode as always it's available here too if you're looking for some other things, notification headers is a good kind of thing. Center notification headers is a good kind of thing. I'm using this build from past two days approximately. And as you can see, I have the screen usage since full charge is 10 hours, more than 10 hours. I can reset the battery stats also, but I haven't reset it them yet. Styles and wallpapers options is available here where you will not be able to create your own style, which is kind of a disadvantage. USB card emulation, device specific settings where it's included the 90 hertz or 120 hertz and of course it's device specific so it's up to you 
including that in security we have the face lock and fingerprint both of the things are available these are the things i just wanted to let you know link is in the description thanks for watching and goodbye have a nice day